Number 1. Zebra. Zebras are among the wild animals living in Africa with black and white colors. They can protect themselves better against predators as they live in small groups or large flocks. Zebras, which have many enemies such as lions, crocodiles and hyenas, are strong wild animals. His most important weapon is to deal deadly blows to the enemy with his hind legs. Unlike horses and donkeys, zebras have a more wild character and their weight reaches up to 350 kg. Therefore, it is a magnificent feast for hungry hunters such as lions and hyenas. Usually slower than horses, zebras can survive fierce predators thanks to their stamina. When chased by a powerful predator like a lion, they make sudden maneuvers to the right and left, making it difficult for the wild animal to attack. When zebras have to defend, they rumble, double throw or bite. This defense is one to watch out for for most wild animals. The predator struck by this defense of the zebras can be seriously injured or maimed. In some cases, they can die due to the strong foot impacts of the zebra. Zebras are among the top creatures on the predator's menu. Due to its large weight, there is enough meat for a herd of wild animals. For lions, the strongest cat in the world, zebras mean incredibly delicious prey. Powerful predators, such as lions, set their eyes on the weakest, oldest or youngest juvenile member of the herd while hunting. And when they decide to attack, they quietly approach the herd from many different points and start waiting for the right time. When the moment is right to attack, the zebra tries to hunt down the weakest link of the herd by scaring and dispersing the herd. Sometimes, all zebras can move together to rescue a zebra caught by a zebra herd. Or, when predators attack a powerful zebra, they may face the zebra's dangerous defense. Zebras can take their cubs or young members into the center of the herd to protect him from attack. Strong and robust warrior zebras are found in the outer circle of the herd. This is something that predators such as lions, hyenas and wild dogs would not want. The strongest member of the pack can counterattack to drive the predators out of the area. Desperate hunters or scavengers may stop attacking and seek new prey. Zebra's sense of sight, hearing, taste and smell are highly developed. Thanks to these highly sensitive senses, zebras are prepared for dangers that may come from all sides. Zebras may have to cross rivers in times of migration. Underwater killers can lurk and launch relentless attacks on zebras. They have to fight with lions, hyenas and wild dogs on land and crocodiles in the water. Lions, hyenas, wild dogs and crocodiles are not the only enemies of zebras. Zebras may also have to fight with their own kind. The mother zebra can go into a deadly fight to protect her cub from angry male zebras.
If the mother zebra wins the battle, the baby zebra will survive. However, if the male zebra wins, the baby tries to kill the zebra. Zebras are one of the most popular, sweet and beautiful animals in nature. However, it can be very dangerous when it gets angry. Zebras sleep only if there are other animals around to warn of predators. Zebras, which are definitely visited in zoos, can live much longer in captivity. Zebras' black and white stripes help keep them cool as well as camouflage them in tall grass. Zebras are very fast animals. This speed of zebras means they are fast enough against predators such as lions. Zebras who can search for an individual who has disappeared from the herd for hours or even days establish a very social life with their own members. At any moment, they walk around with other animals such as antelope, giraffe, ostrich and other alert animals against possible attacks. It struggles selflessly to feed and protect its offspring. The defense of zebras seems to be quite strong in this battle for survival in the wild. It's a tough prey for predators like lions, leopards, cheetahs, hyenas and wild dogs. It can give hunters a hard time with both biting and hind foot impacts. To survive, the zebra must fight with all its might. Number 2. Warthog. A wild boar breed living in Africa from the genus Porcine family. These warthogs do not spend their time in mud deposits like domestic pigs. In the wild they always have to be careful to be wary of predators. That's why they don't show a relaxed demeanor like other domestic pigs. Their attention is always at the highest level to protect their kittens from all kinds of danger and especially from big cats. Warthogs and wild boars can also sometimes take mud baths. But this is only to cool off and let her skin get rid of parasites. As warthogs live in flocks of 15 to 20 individuals, they can defend against any predator together. While defending, it tries to injure or kill the enemy with its long and sharp teeth. If a warthog is caught by a predator such as a lion or a leopard, it uses its power to not collapse and defend itself. Sometimes they hide in giant holes they dig or tunnel like burrows. Sometimes other friends in the herd can come for help and save him from the hunter. The warthog has many enemies. Some of those, lion, tiger, leopard, crocodiles, hyenas, wild dogs, jackals, foxes. Many wild animals can enter the hunting menu. The world's strongest animal, the king of forests, lions often prefer warthogs. 
Since the lions divide up the work among themselves, they scatter the warthog herd and catch one of them. Likewise, it is on the hunting menus of tigers, the biggest cat in the world. Warthogs and wild boars can be very heavy, so even a lion or a tiger can have a hard time. The wild boars and warthogs fear the most predators are hyenas and wild dogs. The hyena and wild dog move with the group while attacking a prey. That's why these predators are the kind that warthogs don't like. Warthogs can engage in a great battle to protect the offspring, their nest and territory from hunters and predators. It can fight rivals that are much stronger for his offspring than himself. The warthog's body functions like a soaping mechanism. It uses its long-haired skin like a mud-hardened armor. Since its body is bulging on both sides, it can easily lead itself through bushes and heaths. There is no bush he could not enter. Its hard skin and deep eyes protect it from thorns. Thus, it provides an advantage while avoiding big cats such as lions, tigers and leopards. Warthogs run very fast, although their legs are very short compared to body height. Warthogs have a slightly different neck structure so they cannot move their heads easily. They cannot change direction quickly because they run fast and cannot move their head easily. Scavengers such as hyenas and wild dogs can maneuver comfortably because they cannot change direction quickly while running. Warthogs, which can also be eaten by crocodiles while drinking water, must always be cautious. Warthogs, who have to be very careful while drinking water, resting, eating, feeding their young, can reach quite large weights. They can try all kinds of defensive strategies to protect their offspring from predators. With its long and pointed teeth, it can make fatal attacks on its opponents. In this way, he can seriously injure his enemy and protect his offspring from attack. At the same time, it is not easy to drop a warthog on the ground because its skin consists of hard hair and its feet are firmly on the ground. Warthogs with very strong legs can be quite aggressive and angry when they feel their young in danger. At this point, he tries to make every effort to keep his opponent away from his offspring and territory. But even if he loses his cub when he meets a lion herd, he does not dare to attack the lions alone. Although it is difficult for the mother warthog not to protect her baby, it is also impossible to fight the lion herd alone. Although warthogs are always ideal prey for predators and scavengers, they are among the wild animals that need attention. It's not enough just to be strong to win in the wild. Sometimes you can win the war even by making a good defense. Or by doing a good attack and a good defense at the same time. 
you have watched the dangerous world of well-defended warthogs. Number 3. Buffalo. Here is a king with horns. An animal that can kill lions with their horns. It is one of the largest mammals living on land. Buffaloes. Buffaloes are very strong and brave animals. They are the largest known wild bulls. Buffaloes living in a wide area in Africa generally do not live alone. In this way, buffaloes living in flocks protect themselves from dangers. Buffaloes generally prefer to graze near water. In general, buffaloes that move slowly are only mobile in case of danger. When they have to flee, they turn to their enemies and stand face to face. With their powerful size and deadly horns, they give predators like lions a hard time. Although they usually live in herds, Indian buffaloes are known as dangerous animals that often stay away from the main flocks. These Indian buffaloes, separated from the main herd, are very fearless compared to other species. Such animals can even attack elephants or attack native buffalo herd. However, any animal left alone whet the appetite of predators. Especially lions. Lions, the strongest big cat in the world, can hunt all kinds of animals. The hunting lists are quite diverse and there are also buffaloes in their menus. Lions and buffaloes, who often encounter each other, fight fiercely among themselves. The primary goal of lions is to catch a buffalo that moves apart from the herd. Moving away from the herd, a buffalo can be trapped by a pack of lions. Buffaloes in herds have little chance of being attacked by predators such as lions. A lion in the middle of a buffalo herd has made the worst mistake of his life. It is very difficult to get out of the buffalo herd intact. With an angry and aggressive attitude, buffaloes can strike lions with horns and kill them. Defense mechanisms are very robust. The priority of buffaloes living in herds is always their offspring. Protecting your offspring is very important for the future of the herd. The protection of the young in the herd is of great importance for adult buffaloes. Because the first target of predators in attack is juvenile buffaloes. That's why adult buffaloes are always around the offspring. In this way, they protect him from predators such as lions and hyenas. Cubs are seen as easy prey for lions. But protective buffaloes do not allow this. Buffaloes have an aggressive attitude. In some cases, this aggressive behavior can kill a flock or a predator. There can also be great wars among themselves. They can seriously injure or kill each other for supremacy and leadership. 
In addition, his protective instincts are highly developed. They have the courage and strength to save a buffalo attacked in a herd. The king of the forests can defend himself even against the lion. Number 4. Giraffe The tallest animals in the world. Giraffes, whose habitat is Africa, have many enemies in nature. The biggest enemy of giraffes are lions. They are hunted by lions, the strongest cats in the world. Baby giraffes are also prey to spotted hyenas, leopards and African wild dogs. The lions, the king of the forests, attack the giraffes while attacking them in packs and dividing the work among themselves. Giraffe is one of the most difficult animals to hunt. Giraffes don't live alone either. They form large groups in flocks. Leaving the herd, a giraffe becomes vulnerable to many dangers. It alone tries to keep predators away with its strong legs and deadly foot blows. Giraffe foot blows can severely injure or even kill lions. Since lions know this, male lions are also at work in hunting. Giraffes also have to be very careful when they come to rivers or lakes for drinking. It can be attacked by a giant crocodile underwater, or it could be prey to a gang of lions lurking in the bushes. That's why giraffes, no matter how strong they are, act by thinking that danger can come from anywhere. Lions are not the only enemies of giraffes in nature. At the same time, giraffes can wage great wars among themselves. They plan to beat their opponent with hard neck strokes. The giraffe that fell or was injured retreats and admits that he lost the battle. In this struggle for supremacy in the group, male giraffes can cause serious damage to each other. Male giraffes maintain social hierarchy through fights using their necks. With this victory, dominant giraffes are eligible to mate with females. The main food source of giraffes is the leaves of the acacia tree, which they eat at heights beyond the reach of other mammals. Male giraffes are 4.4 to 5.5 meters tall and weigh 1.5 tons. These animals are known as the gigantic tall animals of the wild. Giraffes are tough prey for predators and scavengers. Predators other than lions may not be able to attack these large-sized giraffes. They try to hunt the young of their giraffes, the tallest animal living on land. However, lions, nicknamed kings, can hunt giant giraffes with other members of the group. Lions have very high jumping ability. So while trying to hunt the giraffe, it tries to jump on its neck and drop it to the ground. However, giraffes should not be taken lightly. 
giraffes, which are densely populated in countries such as Kenya, Tanzania and Botswana, can detect dangers from afar. When a male giraffe meets lions, he tries to defend himself. Giraffes fight fiercely with their opponent thanks to their fatal rear foot blows. Giraffe can severely damage lions with dangerous foot blows. The giraffe's strong legs are his most trusted defense against lions with a muscular body. It is a creature that will do anything to protect itself and its cub from predators such as lions and hyenas. Survive in the wild as with any living creature, giraffes will face some difficulties to survive. They can overcome these difficulties with a good defense method. Predators and scavengers must hunt in order to survive. Animals such as elephants, giraffes, antelopes, zebras, deer, gazelles, on the other hand, must make good defenses against predators. The best defender will survive. Others will be supper of predators like lions and tigers. This incredible war will always continue. Number 5. Elephant. the largest animal living on land. It is one of the most powerful animals in the world with its hoses and sharp teeth. A rival to be feared. Elephants, two species of Asian elephants and African elephants, have few enemies. The most known enemy of these is the lion herds. The male African elephant can reach 4 meters in length and 7,000 kilograms in weight. That's why no animal wants to fight an elephant. But some fearless animals like elephants can even stand up to elephants. Animals such as rhinoceros, hippopotamus, buffalo, and lions may encounter elephants. They use their long and pointed incisors as a weapon while fighting. While the lions attack the elephants, they try to attack together with the group. A male lion alone can kill a baby elephant. Since the relationship between elephants is very high, every individual is very important. Herbivorous elephants. It is found in natural habitats such as savanna, forest, desert, and swamp. Elephants, who generally prefer to stay near water, also try to get into the water and cool off with their hoses. Generally, animals prefer to stay away from elephants. Predators such as lions, tigers, hyenas, and wild dogs only attack baby elephants. However, big cats such as lions and tigers can also attack large elephants. Elephants can sometimes form large communities with family groups coming together. Elephants are one of the smartest animals in the world. It has been observed that they show empathy towards dying elephants or animals of their own kind. They do not take their offspring away to protect him from all kinds of danger. Elephants can move both forwards and backwards, but they cannot jump. They can overturn gigantic trees with their teeth and proboscis. It is one of the strongest animals with the best defense against predators.
they can severely injure or maim a lion with only their trunks. It is very difficult to survive for a lion or tiger falling into a herd of elephants. So it can be quite dangerous for predators to consider an elephant for a dinner. With their trunks, teeth, and huge weight, elephants are a fearful prey. Number 6. Gazelle. It is an animal species that can live all over the world except the polar regions. It is a very agile and fast animal. Its maneuverability is very high while running. Male gazelles have horns that can be considered dangerous. There may be great battles between males to influence the female gazelle. At the same time, male gazelles can engage in brutal struggles with each other for the struggle for leadership. Male gazelles are not an easy bite for predators because of both their horns and speed. Male lions or leopards have a hard time keeping up with gazelles when it comes to speed. However, cheetahs, the world's fastest land predators, can reach this high speed. Cheetahs are also capable of maneuvering at high speed, just like gazelles. Gazelles, like other buffaloes, deer and zebras, live in flocks. The male gazelle controls the herd. Approaching the herd, a foreign male can enter a deadly duel with the gazelle. They try to attack each other with horns. The one who is strong and can defend well wins the war. The male gazelle that wins the war has the right to protect the females in the herd. Gazelles frequently encounter predators such as cheetahs, leopards and lions in nature. Since leopards have high camouflage ability, they try to catch gazelles by ambushing them. Cheetahs use their speed. Wild dogs, thanks to their tireless energy, can follow the gazelle until it gets tired. That's why gazelles try not to get away from the herd they are in. It is necessary to protect juvenile gazelles in any attack. Because the first target of predators like glades and cheetahs is baby gazelles. Gazelles can protect themselves against predators with their horns, speed and athletic build. It is not easy to knock down the gazelle due to their agile structure and strong legs. It is a creature that can take any risk to protect its offspring. They are animals that can defend well against predators in the wild. Although it is on the menu of many animals, it should not be seen as an easy hunt. A creature capable of showing any struggle to survive. You watch the dangerous world of gazelles. Number 7. Wildebeest. 
also known as ox-headed antelopes. Living continents are Africa. Their habitats are especially in the Serengeti Plains. Wildebeests have many natural enemies. It has many enemies such as lions, leopards, hyenas, and wild dogs. Since wildebeests generally roam in herds, they can protect themselves against predators. These animals, weighing between 150 and 300 kilograms, are a delicious meal for predators. These wildebeests, who migrate once or twice a year due to drought, encounter many different dangers in nature. He has to be very cautious even when drinking water. They can be a food for crocodiles with high bite force waiting underwater. It belongs to the family Bovidae, which includes antelopes, cattle, goats, sheep, and other even toad-horned ungulates. These animals, which travel in large flocks in places such as Serengeti and Masai Mara, are also very successful in terms of defense. It can repel opponents with its horns and strong feet. It is a creature that does not give up easily even in a lion attack. Major predators that feed on wildebeest include the lion, hyena, African wild dog, cheetah, leopard, and crocodile, which seem to favor the wildebeest over other prey. It is important to be strong to win a war. Wildebeest are very strong and can inflict landlord injury even to a lion. The most important tactic of these animals is this. Defensive tactic is herding, where the young animals are protected by the older, larger ones, while the herd runs as a group. Number 8. Porcupine. Here is a small and very tough competitor. One of the toughest prey for predators. The king of the forests can even give lions a hard time. They can seriously injure or even kill lions. With such a small but dangerous creature, dazed predators can fight. A prey with which leopards and lions will fight without blinking. Lions and leopards need to be very careful when attacking the porcupine. It is not easy to catch the arrowed porcupine by the neck. The porcupine with the arrow shows his thorns by turning his back to the side where the move is coming. Predators and scavengers who attack unstable and careless become targets of thorns. Some leopards and lions may die due to thorns hitting the heart. They remove the thorns that hit the body as a result of long efforts. The arrowed porcupine is such an incredible creature. It is one of those rare animals that are so small in size and can pose such a danger. However, the predators that hunt the arrow porcupine separate it from their thorns before they eat it. Being hungry can do everything for some creatures. All hungry big cats can attack any creature they can eat. Every living thing has its own defense. This defense tries to protect himself from all kinds of danger. 
Of course, attacking predators also have great attack abilities. Some have very strong jaws and some have very strong claw strokes. This fight, which is not easy for the porcupine with arrows, is like a breathtaking battle in nature. The arrowed porcupine can stand up to any predator with its large spines on this gorgeous dorsal area. Number 9. Hippopotamus. One of the animals with the strongest jaw pressure in the world. Hippos are a feared rival with their huge bodies and big teeth. With its sharp teeth, high speed and large size, it is one of Africa's most powerful animals. Hippos live in herds of nearly 20 individuals. Men strongly defend their control areas against each other. Defending its territory is very important for hippos. They can fight each other fearlessly for their domination. Men who compete with each other engage in heavy fights that can also end in death. Hippos usually come ashore at night and eat the grass they find on the plains. Hippos also have enemies. The best known of these enemies are lions and crocodiles. Lions and crocodiles want to attack young hippos. However, young hippos rarely have success as they are protected by adults. They can cut an adult crocodile in half in one bite. They have that strong jaws. Canines up to 50 centimeters are their most dangerous weapon. No wild animal wants to be bitten by a hippopotamus with a very high bite force. Hippos spend their time in the water and near water. However, they can sometimes be disturbed by scavengers such as hyenas or wild dogs. Hippos intimidate them by opening their mouths enormously. Although they have a calm nature, they can be very aggressive and angry when stimulated. They are very strong animals that can defend well against predators in the wild. They are not easy to be hunted and caught by predators. Number 10. Rhinoceros. It is the largest animal species after the elephant among the animals living on land. Today it lives only in Africa, Malaysia, Indonesia and India. But they even lived in Europe in the past. Rhino's most important weapons are their giant horns. They can kill their opponent with giant horn blows. Adult rhinoceros have no real predators in the wild, other than humans. Adult rhinos are so strong that predators and scavengers hesitate to approach. Young rhinos can however fall prey to big cats, crocodiles, African wild dogs, and hyenas. Experienced and warlike rhinos try to protect the young ones from predators. Rhinos are aggressive and resistant animals. When he gets angry, he can attack whoever gets in front of him. So much so that even a giant elephant can stand up. If an adult rhino has a baby with him, he will defend it at the cost of death. It doesn't care how strong and dangerous the opponent is. Animals such as hippos and elephants have to be very careful with their huge horns. They can be seriously injured or lose their life with horn blows. The Sumatran rhinoceros is the smallest extant rhinoceros species.
It can be found at very high altitudes in Borneo and Sumatra. The most important advantage of predators such as lions, hyenas and wild dogs is that they attack in packs. They try to defeat the opponent by attacking in a flock. However, it shows that rhinos will be very difficult due to their thick skin and strong structure. Sometimes they can struggle for leadership among themselves. After winning the war, the rhinoceros declares its leadership and becomes a voice in the region. Despite their tonal weight, they are very agile and fast animals. Both African species and the Sumatran rhinoceros have two horns, while the Indian and Javan rhinoceros have a single horn. Attacking a mother rhino with a baby is the end of that predator. The mother rhino can destroy her opponent without mercy. If you like this videos, don't forget to like and leave your comment below. Also subscribe to our channel Wild Animal TV for more videos like this. Thanks for watching.